Hi, it's the 5th of August 2019. We're here in a crop of Seberka soybeans here in Essex uh, near Chipping Onga. Um, there's a couple of hundred acres here, I think. If you look right down there, right across there, uh, sweeps all the way up. And of course, this adjacent field here, it's a big one, there's about 100 acres in there as well. So there's 200 and odd acres here in a block. Things to note here, well, first of all, it's a cracking crop. This is what a crop of soya is supposed to look at, look like uh, in August. Very happy with this. You'll see the height of it. It's up about here at the moment. Pretty good. It'll probably come up a bit further, probably finish up about here. Um, it's very healthy. It's had some trace elements. It's also had the weed control done on it. So not expensive to grow so far, really. It is a low input crop soya anyway. So I think obviously it's had a pre-emergence herbicide. I think it's had the post M herbicide, which would have had a fungicide with it. Uh, cheap, simple fungicide. Uh, I think it might have had a graminicide, not sure and then some trace elements. That's it. And, well, cracking crop. This should do well, this crop. Obviously it's Severka. Severka is the number one variety in the UK. Nearly all soy in the UK is Severka. Things to note about Severka is this. Thick stem. Gives a great standing power keeps the pods and everything up off the deck. Once this crop matures, harvestability is the name of the game. Severka, light years ahead of the old varieties, light years ahead of a lot of foreign varieties that are even around now. If you're gonna grow soy in the UK, this is what you need. Architecture to your plant structure. So, that's it. Let's wait and see how this crop does, but bodes well, should be at least a ton an acre. Thank you.